Okay, everyone, here we are. We are on to the next step, and this happens to be the last one, but this will give you an idea. So what we've done is we've opened up our package. These are, and I'll go ahead and link to them in the description. This is part number 2474202, and this is for the 24-valve setup, so both 5.9s and 6.7s. What we've got here is just our standard ARP head stud, and... What we've done is we've cleaned everything up per the instructions. We've got our big can, and I'll also go ahead and link that in the description so you've, we've got a big can so that you're ha not having to deal with this. So if you're going to do more than one of these, highly recommend. It's got the brush in it and makes it so much faster. Um, we went ahead and washed everything up. We have oiled the bottom side. So the the if we can get that in focus there, let's see... Uh, nope, it's not going to focus there. We'll just do it manually. Um, so we went ahead and we've oiled the bottom side and we've put all ARP Ultra Torque on the top. Um, I find that it's easiest to do this while the stud is out. Um, and then we'll hit the rest of them. So we've gone ahead and we've cleaned this up. I've got my buddy Eli who's been helping me tonight. And we've gone over here and you can see that we've got most of them in. We're going to come to this hole right here. Eli, if you want to do the honors, since you've done all the other ones, you drop it in there. And, we'll, yep, you see them? We've got it. These go in basically hand tight. So we'll go over here. Get a better angle on it. Okay, so he's just going to run that down. While he's running that down, um, and the reason why you don't really want to bottom these out. So you just go, go to lay stop. Hopefully you've cleaned your threads at the bottom of the block. Um, and ARP, if you look at the instructions, um, it'll tell you that the there is a set that are six and I think it's six point six two five inches long. They're a little bit longer, and they go on the exhaust side of the motor. So if you're doing this build and you're getting ready for head studs, remember the longer studs go along the exhaust bank right over here. And you're going to put them in basically hand tight, and that should be pretty easy as long as your threads have been chased and cleaned out. So we're going to go ahead and go back over here, and then we're just going to show you what this looks like. So what we would do next is we've already pre-washed these guys. We're going to, we're going to take our ARP Ultra Lube here, or Ultra Torque, sorry, I'm getting it mixed up with our assembly lube. And we'd go ahead and we would cover both sides of the nut and the washer. So I'm going to stick it on pause. And I'll come back once we've got that on there. Okay, so what we've got here is we've gone ahead and we put ARP Ultra Torque on both sides of the washer. And actually, Eli, will you grab the, the can of that? We'll go ahead and, and go ahead and pull the brush out and go ahead and smear some on the, the top side of the head right there. Get it right on the base of the head there. Smear it right on the metal. Yep, right down there where it's going to be squishing. Yep. Okay, so now we've got all sides of these things are pretty much equally covered. We're going to go ahead and we're going to pop those on. We're going to pause this video till we have all 10 billion of these nuts and washers with ARP Ultra Torque on them. And then we'll pick it up from there.